hello guys welcome back to my channel today i'm excited to guide you through step-by-step -step tutorial on how to rig your cutter with auto rig pro in blender we will cover all the steps from rigging the body to the face and along the way i will show you how to solve common issues that might arise during the process stick around until the end of this video to ensure that you every aspect of the tutorial To make it easy for Auto Rig Pro to make your character rig easy, you have to make sure you have the upper teeth and the lower teeth also being separate, and you also have the tank also being separate, the left eye and the right eye. Also, you have to make sure all of them has been separate. So I'm going to unhide everything and begin the rigging. So when I go to my tab here, I can see I have the auto rig tab and I'm press A to select everything. On here we can see we have auto rig smart this is the one you are going to use so i'm going to click on get selected object and i'm going to read the full body so i'll choose the full body and it's okay so that's i'm going to align this to the neck and this one's go to the chin so the shoulder and we'll go to the wrist and go to the spine root and this goes to the ankles so after this we need to go and do the fascia one so click on add fascia and it will bring us to here so here i'm going to align this one to the eyebrows you see the hair is blocking it so we can go to object and select the hair and hide that one now we can go back to edit mode and continue so this one also goes to the ears and this one go to the chin the check and this is the mouth so you can use l to link select and i'm going to align this one to the mouth part and this one supposed to be aligned with the nose so after this we have these options here auto rig post mark eyeball object tank object Seat object optional so here i'm going to select them all so i'll go back to object mode and i will select the left eye and i'll click on the eyeball i'll set it to and i'll choose this one as the eye the left eye and i'll select the right eye and click on this and it will pick that one so i'm going to hide the body so i can see the inside so this is the upper teeth i'm going to choose upper teeth and this is the lower teeth and this one goes to the tank so choose that one that that i'm going to hide and i can click on ok so now from here what i have to do is check every side and see if it has aligned perfect and i can click on go nice it has been generated so let me check if the fingers are perfect aligned you can see everything seems good here so after this what i have to do is click on match to rig and this is going to generate a rig control for us and you can see it has been generated so i'm going to test if the able move back you can see it's working good here that's pretty nice so the next thing you have to do is you are going to bind this to the character and it here is going to seem simple i don't want the hair to be deformed so i'm going to hide the hair because i don't want deforming and the base the earrings so i'm going to hide that part also because i don't want deformation from that part so the next thing i have to do is select everything and shift select the rig last and go to skin and i'm going to click on bind done it has been successfully binding so here i'm going to check if it is has bound perfect you can see that's good but you can see something is happening here here is opening and some other thing okay let me check the hand okay you can see this part is like tearing or something it's hard but let's check the face if the face is working okay the face is working perfect and the tank Okay, the tank is also working so how we can fix that other part I'm going to reset my rig pose here i'm going to use visualize to bind the character so i'm going to select everything and shift select um search the bone and here the engine i'm going to choose visualize and i'm going to hit on bind again and check what will happen for this 
done this one now has been bind so let me go and check with this one how it is working but you can see this one seems good so let me go and select everything and go to object i want to set shade to smooth and this one will be fixed so you can see this one uh it is not appearing here let me check this part and you can see also here it has been fixed that's pretty good but if you check here when you try to open the mouth you can see the mouth is not opening so how can we fix this for for auto rig you can see the heat maps work perfect for the fissure and sometimes the fingers okay let me check the fingers and see if the fingers working perfect you can see the fingers also not working good here for the verse light so how can we fix this it's going to be simple here how we can do that so i'm going to uh select everything on parent okay since everything is working on this side only the face and the hand is not working properly so this is what i'm going to do i'm going to select the body and i'll go to edit mode and i'll go to wireframe so here i'm going to use b for box select and select the hand and use select this hand also and i'm going to select only the head part so i'm going to select the head and other face okay and after that i'll go back to object mode and i'm going to choose heat maps and i'll check this selected vertex only and here i'll shift select the rig and hit bind again after this let me go and check if it has been fixed now you can see the mouth is opening and the fingers also working perfect you know, we can also move and this one will be working the fault everything is working quietly here so now let's go and bind the hair so i'm going to unhide that part and also the ear rings so i'm going to select this and shift select the rig and go to post mode and here i want to select only the head dot s and control plus p and choose bone i'm going to do the same for the earrings i'm going to shift select that one and i'll shift select the rig go to post mode and i'm going to bind it to the ear so shift choose bone and then from that part you can see you can move all of them like that and it will respond okay. so this is the end of this tutorial and thank you for watching and make sure you subscribe to my channel and if you have any question make sure you leave it in the comment section and i'll reply you